Just keep rolling, 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 rolling. Yo, 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 yo. Mic check one, two. Mic check one, two. Yo. Main Trafford Podcast, episode 106. You already know what time it is. 106 and part? (laughs) Yeah. Come on, dog. Part. Yeah. (laughs) Um, You already know what time it is. Come on. 106. Um, Boys, introduce yourself. Big two on the building, Don Corleone. The one and only. Nah, I'm saying. It's the Black Mamba Dove. Yeah, you should already know who it is. <laughs> yeah, it's Eman G45. You should already know who it is. That's, a, that's a fact. It's very solid. 45 is always silent. Yeah, <laughs> just remember that. I got mm. a. Yeah! Me. Right, you're awake now. Yeah? You're sorry. Let's get into it, Demi. Give the energy that is necessary for All this right. podcast. Two Dems, you already know what time it is. If you don't know, now you know. The what Veard is right back. Now? The Veard is back. Yes, sir. What time is it right now? Yo, if you're watching this, we are recording at 8.54pm. That's how you know we love you. We're yes, coming sir. At, coming at real time to give you that real mm. that real shit. Yes, sir. Mm. My girl can think we... Just look in the camera and tell him. <laughs> uh, it is 8.54pm and we are live. Do you know what always makes me laugh? You know when I'm kiss kiss at the beginning when that man's on the radio? My girl in there won't love me no more. <laughs> <laughs> Call her on line one. Yeah, Call her. Live. Nah, continue, continue. I'm just that was a fantastic song. Fantastic. Okay, so let's jump straight into it. We're 30 seconds in. You want to know what we're discussing. So, can remakes be good? The reason I brought this to our attention is because I've seen they're doing oh, a remake of... For my show. Too sexy for my. Oh, Do you know what? I like that song. It's going on me. I can't even catch. Oh still, no! It's still dead. <laughs> oh no! Still, still dead. I can't, still believe, dead. I can't <laughs> believe that went to number one. Let me do. Listen. Someone said the um, the top ten this week looked like a Drake playlist with uh, <laughs> a Kid Leroy song in the middle. <laughs> Shouts out to the boy, man. He did his thing. I have to give credit where credit is due. The album is still pants, but you know, it's what it is. Uh, so topic. First topic. Can remakes be good? I'm intrigued by this Fresh Prince of Bel-Air uh, remake. I don't think it's necessary, uh, especially when the power of the original Fresh Prince is still very there. prominent. Yeah. Um, how do we feel? Do you... Has there been good remakes? I'm trying to think. I think that's a silly thing to say, but I can't think of any that stand out. It's hard. It's borderline impossible. One thing I did enjoy, and I might get a bit of a backlash for this, I actually quite enjoyed Space Jam 2. Really? I kind of thought it was alright. That film looked like CGI on top of CGI. I thought it was alright. I liked the references. I, in fact, I loved the references. Have you seen it? No. Have you seen it? No. There's a lot of good basketball references, which mm. I very much thoroughly enjoyed. The story was nonsensical. Yeah, it looked dumb as fuck. LeBron was just like in a hurry every single scene. Um, Don Cheadle was role was trash. <laughs> he's a good you could you know when you see a good actor when you know he's been giving a shit role but he was hard enough was. like i respected it he just went <laughs> he tried it. yeah and um yeah it was a very it was very much so a cgi advertisement fest mm. but i liked what they were doing and the, the the meaning behind the story and i loved the references that made me laugh yeah, be- if i'm michael b jordan i'm beating people up you know that was that and I didn't see that coming. I'll be honest with you. <laughs> I, was, I thought that was funny as fuck. It's a good. It wasn't a bad movie. If you have kids, I ain't got kids. But if you have kids, you or you watch the, it with younger, they'll enjoy it. Yeah. Um. But yeah, in general, I mean, the first Space Jam isn't like. I, I, it's not like creme it's de la creme. Not a good film it's just nostalgia in it. It's just nostalgia. Hundred and ten percent. What you think? Space Jam one's a good yeah. film. It's just nostalgia, nah, bro. Nah, it's, it's, it's I watched it recently. It's, it's, and it's different. It's different. It's different. It's a trailer. It's, it's an different. absolute mess. I said it's film. different, and that's it. Full stop. Do you know what makes it legend? Oh no, I can't even say this. What? I value our podcast. Mm. I was gonna say, do you know what makes it legendary? The what? soundtrack. Oh no. <laughs> There's a certain man on the soundtrack which I won't name, who has um, a legendary song on the soundtrack, but he's cancelled. No, I mean the original. I said Porky oh. the Pig. You know how you, he's on our way. He's not my wavelength now. Ah, right, yeah. A certain. What when he was bold? Yeah, yeah. a certain R to the. Yeah, niggas killing me with this shit, man. <laughs> <laughs> Is this camera on me? It's got, it's got, it's got R Kelly tax, so we can't really enjoy. It. We nah, can't enjoy nah. it that much anymore. What was I gonna um, say? Who's in charge of this? I saw the soundtrack for this new one, but I hate when they do this shit, man. Like no one. <laughs> Reefa Franklin and Lil Baby. <laughs> What? Say what? No. On my life, Aretha That's Franklin cap. and Lil Baby. Aretha Franklin. I think it's Aretha Franklin. Yo, what the? Fuck? I'm not even. I'm not even guessing. Nah, I thought it was Lil Baby and Kirk Franklin. 
Kirk Franklin, not Aretha Franklin. That's Aretha Franklin. Aretha Franklin. Aretha Franklin. Aretha Franklin. Aretha Franklin. I was about to say, R-E-S-P-E-C-T. She's no, 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 she's like, passed away. Rest in peace, sir, Aretha Franklin. Yeah, yeah, Kirk Franklin, yeah. my bad. You saved yourself, bro. Yikes. Yikes. Aretha Yikes. Franklin, you know. I've had a man Kirk there. Franklin. Yeah, man. I mean, what do a man have to even talk about? You know what? You know when them, you they're not even... Fuck you, yeah. Don't come round. <laughs> Did you not hear the story? What? With Kirk Franklin and his son. Oh, yes. <laughs> The way he just baited it out and said, no, listen, fuck, excuse my language, fuck you, yeah, no, 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 this, this, and that, fuck you, don't come round the house, if I, if I catch you here, I'm giving you hands. Damn. This is, this that was is, not this very is... Christ-like, was it? No, it wasn't Christ-like. Any really Christ-like. <laughs> no. Looking at the ground, man, I don't even like likes, you know that what I'm is, saying? Oh, my God. Who's writing for this, man? I like that song. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy it. Anyway. Was, uh, was amazing. Yikes. But Next yes, year, continue so can remakes work? In general, no, man. You're chasing a bar that you're never going to reach, mm. typically. Um, but, you know, it, sometimes it works. I don't really... Maybe it's like a time frame thing. Maybe well, we maybe. need a certain amount of time to pass yeah. in order for you to do it. For example, like uh, Planet of the Apes. Like, I ain't seen the original ones. Yeah. I don't plan to see the original ones. But it was a long enough time, time. gap that the, when the, the new thing, ones came out, they were cold. Yeah. But the thing is, they weren't like... It was in. It was only in name only. They weren't similar to the film which came out. But that's like most remakes, no? They always nah, do as, as deviate remake, from. Yeah, a, do you mean? Do you mean specifically movies that follow the formula yeah, of like, the original? C- clean. If that makes sense, near on beat for beat, bar for bar. When does that happen, though? Typically, I guess this is an example. But I don't know how how similar they're going to make this remake of um, Fresh Prince. I mean, for me, I mm. guess there's di- there's differences in the sense that. That is very, very different. The fresh, uh, not the fresh prints, but the uh, Planet of the Apes ones that you're referring to. Yeah. Um, um, and this is a series, not a film. No, nah, it's a series, I want to say. Okay. Yes, yeah, it's, it's, it's a series. It's a series. Um, I, I don't, I don't. You know don't, what? Cause how, because the thing is, all those TV shows at that time, at that specific time, was talking about family. Mm, it was very mm. family orientated. Even though Will Smith was a cousin, he was still within a family household. Everybody knows Uncle Phil. Mm. Yeah. Do you get what I'm saying? I'm hearing it. Yeah. So then now we live in a in a time where there's single parent households. How will you now make that story relatable to them? How will you now incorporate that sort of that situation? I, and then yeah. also, how are you now going to incorporate it in with, with Bel Air Curry at the moment? With California. Mm. California back then was completely different to the way it is now. It is now. now. I think, yeah, I, yeah, everything you said is true as well. Like, I don't, I think a smarter idea might have been to tell a different story, even maybe flip it. Um, I don't know. Like, it's still within uh, that idea, but you could have done something like, I don't know, maybe Carlton's child goes to live in Philadelphia mm. in, in the rougher parts. No, it has to be rougher, but just has a different experience. Obviously, I'd imagine in this hypothetical situation, Carlton's pretty well off and he wants to give his child an experience that he wouldn't be able to get. I think that would have paid the story, done the story more favours as opposed to what it looks like. They're just going to retell the show the show that we've already seen. Hmm. Yeah, and that way it gives it a bit of legacy. It gives it a bit of, like, uh, ties to the original and it gives you more of an incentive to watch mm. it. Whereas if you're doing it from scratch, you, you run the risk of people... It's trying really to see and the biggest issue is i like i don't know what the format will be are they gonna follow the main you know sitcom um comedy aspect of the original one mm. does that well, even work does that even so work much. anymore yeah, like yeah th- i don't know in what vein is- yeah i didn't even think about that what really. tv shows do we know what sitcoms do we- all the sitcoms we love Brooklyn Nine Nine. they don't have like the laughing back uh track yeah. of the of the audience so how is that going to translate anymore would a, would a humor hit like that i I There's so many questions. No, you're, you're you're totally right as well. It's it's such a good question. To, like, what's the format of the show going to be? Because I think once you get that, you'll have a clearer picture on what they're going for. Mm-hmm. But pff, at the moment, I'm not. I don't. I don't know. It's, it doesn't seem like it's a. It's, it's a it's tall a order, good, man. Good idea. It's a tall order. There's no reason why they can't have success with it, and I'm sure. I hope Will's involved to some degree. I think I'd feel a bit more confident in it if he's given its backing because he'd be like, "Yo, at least." I made the original and I, I stand by this and I think this will be good as well. But if he's not even involved, then I don't know, my concerns grow a little bit. Mm. Yeah. Mm. 
We'll see, man. I think nostalgia, like we said in the uh, previous episode, when we spoke about Space Jam originally. We did say, you know, nostalgia will always sell. So we're gonna tune in just to see whether it's good or not. But you know, following um, or doing remakes is always it's always tricky. It's, tricky yeah. it's always good when you're able to, you know, do something completely different because you look at the James Bonds as well, for example. Like mm. they said. I think it was the Daniel. I ain't seen the ones. I've seen like maybe one or two Piers Brosnan ones, yeah. but they specifically said we're not going to follow that formula no yeah. more. So maybe it will serve them better to, to do something completely different. different. I agree. Um, I agree. I think that's the that's the that's the. You do a like for like remake. They're going to tell you yeah. why this isn't anywhere near. Why it's trash. Whereas you do something different, they're going to be like, oh, all right, cool. At least you're doing something different. Mm. We can't even. We won't even bother comparing this to the original one anymore. There's I no think point. that's the first thing you have to try and do is not give it room to for comparison to the original second you you're too like for like i think that's when you you create trouble for yourself really absolutely but yeah now it was interesting to just see what you guys think about remakes and can they work i think it i think it all depends in my opinion on how they go about creating the remake and then you just go from there really mm. yes and I, and i think one thing that's um very important is sometimes remakes can work in different realms of media mm. so for example i'm, I'm a bit of a, i'm a big gamer um and there's so, and with 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 gaming it's easy because the technology oh, is yeah. different Always. so when you remake a game nine times out of ten they're gonna bang it because it looks better it, it the gaming is Play better, better yeah. you can even say the same for um it's well i say the same for shoes i don't know if it's always the same for shoes whereas they'll Sometimes. take an original shoe they'll use new materials mm. and it might work better i don't know if that's the case e-man what would you say um, it might not work like that i don't know well in terms of right so in terms of like let's just talk about retro jordans um in terms of the ogs at that time it was designed specifically for performance yeah so there would have been high-end materials used and you would have been able to play in them whereas today they're not performance based anymore yeah and they're now using not necessarily lower quality material, but they're using material enough for you to just walk around in. I mm. mean, that's, that's about it. Does it make it less comfortable? In some areas, yes. So I can definitely, people who are sneakers who are listening to this, they can definitely know the difference between the white cement fours that released in 2012 and the ones that released in 2016. The leather quality is completely different. Um, one is a lot more softer. The 2016 is a lot more softer and it's, it fits nicely and there isn't much of a struggle in terms of the comfort whereas the other one the moment you break into it it's a problem right um but yeah i mean in terms of retro sometimes they do get better and sometimes they get worse but mm. in terms of remakes sometimes they overdo it like with the raging ball um all red jordan fives the suede was a different color and not a lot of people were feeling it mm. and because they mass produced it everybody got a pair so now it loses its it's um uniqueness right of like being this coveted shoe because now everybody has it it's like mm, i wanted this shoe for myself mm. as a sneaker as a collector and then some people wanted it for resale and some people wanted it because it's like oh yeah i want this shoe because it means something to me as well not yeah. in the same level because they knew sneakerheads but then you know yeah there's it's always going to be a new generational thing especially with like the air max 95s they always change until they bring out something like the og yeah where you definitely feel the the pressure the air pressure in each different bubble then yeah and it's like music you hear a song or we'll hear a song then they'll sample it and then we're laughing to ourselves like yeah man listen this is cool this is cute but mm. this, yeah. these times the original is better yeah. so it depends on the medium, I think. Yeah, and I, I think agree. with TV, it's quite... I think TV is probably the... TV and movies is probably yeah, the hardest. It's just the hardest. It's the hardest to um, try and remake or remaster, to be honest with you. With music, you could just sample something and then make it yours. So long as it's original enough. For example, the the Believe What I Say by Kanye West. Yes. It's been stuck in my head for weeks. Yeah. And I still love um, Do What. You know what I mean? I still love the original. But for some reason... Kanye manipulated the original sample so much so that that melody is stuck in my head. Mm. So it depends how it you sounds, do it. It sounds exactly the same as um, Drake's uh, Draft Day. Yeah, but Draft Day he was spitting in it. Yeah, that's why I like yeah because that's his, that's pure melody, bro. Like mm. that that chorus is stuck in my head. Exactly. So yeah. you know it depends how you it depends how you flip it. Agreed. All right. So second topic of the day is who 
Just what is the second topic? Who is your favourite athlete? Mm. What's the issue there? No, nah, no issue. Oh, that's such a, <laughs> that is such a hard question for me. That's well, borderline. Well, it doesn't have to be a favourite athlete. I mean, to be honest, it could be... I've got like a list. It could be Cristiano Ronaldo because he came back to Manchester United. Do you know what I'm saying? You mm. know what I mean? Sue. Mm. Sue. Mm. The Sue would save us. <laughs> <laughs> it would save us as, as long as our manager stays Why, why is... Why Young is, boys wanked off, innit? Why is... What's his name? <laughs> Why is he there? Uh, no, Lingard's good. I'm he's not, a good I'm not player, obvious. but he's, he's it just, was a mistake. It was a he mistake. made a very big mistake. Um, Ronaldo, this is this is why humans are fickle, isn't it? And I, <laughs> I was speaking to you the day it happened. Um, I think I went to go and get a haircut. I was speaking to Demi about it. I was speaking to my barber. I was speaking to Sophie about it, and she, like everybody was like, "Yo, how do you feel about you know Ronaldo coming back or Ronaldo going to to Man City?" And I was just like, "Listen, man, like he's a." He had a time in our in our club. He's not a legend, but he did what he had to do. Um, he's always been for self, etc., yeah. etc. <laughs> yeah. Twelve, 12 well. out, twelve hours later, soon, <laughs> soon. <laughs> really, truly, I was thinking the same thing. I was like, "Come on, bro. I was hurt." Why, I, was never going to I was doing my, I was doing my usual like, self why, defense why mechanism, would you do that, bro. Like, so. That's exactly what what baby did, you know from YMCMB like why wow. why, why are you claiming grip now all of a sudden your blood listen man <laughs> do you know what I'm saying and then now all of a sudden it's like 12 hours later like oh what's happening here humans are fickle as fuck I oh. was doing I was doing my best uh, I was doing my best mature impression when I was message, messaging you Demi like nah. listen man A, B, C and D but deep down in my heart this, this boy was trying to be a pin <laughs> but um, yo he's there for me Rooney's there for me because I grew up I, I, yeah. I remember watching United when he signed so to watch the beginning and the end i've not seen anybody's career yeah mm. beginning yeah, really and end Ruud van Nistelrooy, he was a beast when i when i first yeah, that's my dog watch uh thierry Henry. as much as i didn't like arsenal i thought it was because it's a black man just doing bits yeah, exactly. seeing yeah. him at that level was fantastic for me he managed to duke a lot of uh, young black men into supporting arsenal he almost got me he almost got me yeah, then he fell for the trap. <laughs> I did, man. The club is abysmal right now, man. I'll tell that. Yeah, I'll say that for free. Shambles, Absolute. You know, What's you? Know, who would you guys pick? Oh, man, there's so many. Uh, David Beckham. Like, oh, Beckham's in there for me yeah, as well. Nah, superstar. That, one of the first superstars. It, uh, yeah, first English superstar. Really, yeah. yeah. Um, Didier Drogba, man. Just always thought uh, he used to bully our team, but I just thought he was so cold, just so clinical as well. I love. That's why, I like, for me, I love people who are clutch. You know, yeah, on, the, on, on the big day, he's gonna do it for you. Super That's why he, clutch, bro. he never didn't not. Like, nah, Didier was flames, absolute. Um, I think after watching the last dance, got a new respect for Jordan, but also um, <sighs> Christ, Rodman, man. Dennis that Rodman. boy is is the he's different. weird, but. I love it. He's your spirit animal. Yeah, yeah. Cause you will go out and have a bender, yeah. <laughs> you do a mad thing. And if you are like in his shoes, you're gonna play the next day. Yeah. Like you're on you're on job. That's what I'm doing. He's your spirit nah, animal. Nah, for real, man. My man just was on very much on job. He was, he he was, was on. yeah. Like he, I think on job. There was a game whereby I don't think he scored any points, but he had like thirty rebounds or something ridiculous. Crazy. What he did he was the best at what he needed to do on the court. And it was I love that. Yeah. I love that. He was uh I don't, you know, I think a lot of people could argue that he might not, Jordan might not get his other three rings without Rodman. So, nah, he was, he's elite. That's an elite talent. Um, I mean, there's just so many. I guess, oh, I think a lot of my favourite are in football. I just, the one that really pains me is probably Ronaldinho, man. Because I think to, he was he was unlike anything I've ever seen. Yeah, he's I don't the think I've ever me. seen anything again like Ronaldinho. <laughs> we never will. But he's the goat it's just, me, man. My dad told me like this boy is special, but he likes partying too much. <laughs> and I didn't, I didn't know what he meant. But at PSG, he was this boy was on smoke. I'm mm. talking, couldn't train because he was hungover. Mm. That's what Ronaldinho was on. So, if he was like, if he was brought up in the the um, era of Messi and Ronaldo, where if, even if he had, it was more strict and you know <laughs> players take more care of their fitness. It's not curtains. even worth talking. If Ronaldinho had uh, Ronaldo's. Um, Work ethic curtains. I, I didn't even know what would be. Taught. We wouldn't even. Curtains, it wouldn't curtains, even be a conversation like about who's the best player of all time. It would be Ronaldinho. He has the best highlight reel of all time. I don't think anybody has a <laughs> fucking Giroud. besides Drew. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He has the best highlight reel of all time. Not, not a big football fan, but that's 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 the goal. He's just he's just too peak. Nah, too man, was, peak. I, I, even his first goal <laughs> for, for Barcelona. <laughs> it's one of the it's one of the peakest goals I've ever seen. Mm. He he nah. used to just say, you know what, fuck, like. It was, I, he was so creative as well. I don't even think like really 
it was fair how good he was. You know what I mean? Level above. There's really boys against, like... Boys against men. Yeah, level, level no, above, he was phenomenal. Yeah, he was a level above. Um, <coughs> but there's so many athletes out there that I've, you know, come to enjoy over the last few years. Mm. Um, I can't really think of any, like, more new sort of athletes. I guess, you know, there's, I really like... Michael Jordan, there's definitely Allen Iverson. Allen Iverson was like... Yeah, that's a joke. Yeah, who's yours, man? Who are you thinking? Allen Iverson, Michael Jordan. Any, rec- any more recent uh, ballers? That are in that um, class to for you. To be honest, I, I stopped watching. I stopped watching basketball. Yeah. To be honest, I just stopped a lot of things, man. I don't know. I need. I need to check myself before I wreck myself. <laughs> but um, ball. I get feel back like. Into people, but man. in terms of recent, in terms of recent individuals who are ballers, Trey Young, man, come on, dog. <laughs> That's that boy is a cool. villain. That's the real super villain. <laughs> I lo- and he knows and he plays up to the part. <laughs> he was on WWE. <laughs> He's sick, man. Uh, I would say. Sick Negro. Um, <laughs> The Rosen, very very good. Like De- I, I went to see him DeMar. actually. Yeah, Demar said. Yeah, DeMar, this, was, this was when <laughs> the NBA came to UK and played in O two. Yeah, and he was playing for Toronto at the time. Okay, it was just like, oh, this guy's a fellow. He's, he's a young guy. I think he was drafted into the Toronto at that time. I don't know. I'm not too sure. Um, my memory's not. Uh, what do you think about like uh, Westbrook or um, Steph's up there for me? Killers. Steph really Killers. Uh, yeah, KD. How do you feel about KD? Real killer. Yeah. Real. Easy cold, money sniper. Yeah. Real, real killer. Easy money super, sniper. Super killer. Durantula. Does not listen. <laughs> does not care who you are. Doesn't care about oh yeah teammate corrupt camaraderie whatever. But who do you think is the best player right now in the NBA? Yeah. It's probably still LeBron. No. I don't think like LeBron is is doing statistic games, but he's not the best. Do you know how? Do you know how? Um, someone will come KD and say he's probably the best you think so pure skill. I'm not going to be mad know. at that because it's like it's almost like saying yeah, Ronaldo is the best right now but he's probably not anymore mm. he was but like Giannis is an animal pound. though fuck me and big up to yeah. my Nigerian brother the Greek freak but that boy's getting busy man he gave like, the box a ring there's nothing more to yeah. be said <laughs> he can do whatever he wants for his life what the fuck am I doing in Milwaukee <laughs> come on dog I like some of the guys <laughs> <laughs> I like seven of the Giannis <laughs> slam dunked. The, the fuck f- does he know about Milwaukee? <laughs> nah, man. The boy is too goaded. Um, Steph's up there for me. What about? Uh, I love this guy. What about Dame? Yeah, Dame is peak. He's, he's Dame Dash from the logo, baby. Yeah. Dame is peak. That Dame, time, Dame is that's one of the best shots I've ever seen. Kawhi yeah. is oh my god in the oh, corner, mate. Yeah, that, the world stopped. You know, when there's moments like that, and the ball is bouncing. Fuck, oh, man. I like roasted the, the way they cook Ben Simmons. I think that's funny. <laughs> He's having a whale of a time, man. If he's still in my jammer, enjoy but, yourself, but, King. Yeah, but the thing is, I think with oh. with with these with these athletes, it's it's sustaining yourself. It's like John Wall. John Wall, yeah, a superior mm. athlete. Mm. You know, um, Derek Rose, right? D Rose, mm. still balling now. He's still balling, but not to the same level he was. No, 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 no if no, because no, basically a lot of decisions that have been made because of. Derek Rose because of how many injuries he's had the way he lands like people have actually studied like just him himself and, and how, how to how avoid plays. it and not d- how to avoid a lot of it it's like the way he lands when he dunks everything like the way he balls he, he balls did, like he don't did care did he tear his ACL and that was just it isn't it he basically his knees are like his 50 oh, jeez God. his knees are like his 50 but he's still young enough to play like he's not old. Of course, I hear. Yeah, yeah. He's sad, he's man. he's thirty he's something, but he's still young enough to play and do everything. <laughs> but it's the fact that his knees are gone. What I love though is that how these thirty year olds are pushing the boundaries of how long, you know, uh, yeah, people can put their it's peak on. Science. I think that's all it's fucking down sick to. though. Uh, to be honest, they were retiring at like thirty three when we were younger. And not like, anymore. Yeah, because yeah, yeah because they were yeah. eating the same food. No, of course sick. I agree. Like it's, it's sports because science. When you're when you're when you're twenty, you can get away with that shit. You could, you could definitely get away with a lot of stuff. You could eat whatever you want and then just go and burn it, be energetic the same day. Mm. If you're 30, you got to watch out what you're eating. Fact. Bro, that man you can still outperform a 30-year-old. But more importantly, it's the knowledge you have of the game and how you can tweak everybody. You could just be yeah. out and just make that's someone tweak. That's what I think is the most impressive thing that's really impressed me about Ronaldo over the last, I want to say, 
four years more so. It's just more been his movement. Like his his game intelligence is just had to change yeah. and he's made yeah. it. And work. he's not really exert like if you actually watch Ronaldo play, he's actually not exerting a lot of energy. Like he's just in the right he place at the right time. Exactly. And he's very explos explosive. I think he's one of his biggest Still attributes fast. is his header. So yeah. he's always yeah. Yeah. where he needs to be. His movement is second to none. Like you look at um his first the goal against Young Boys, it was it was just in the right place. 100%. They got that team needs to change their name because that's fucking disgusting. Young and change your stadium. Young boys man. in the wank off. <laughs> anyway. It's a sentence. Yeah. Anyway. What about our Wank Dorf Stadium? <laughs> what about who? Uh what about outside of B Ball? Who who do you say? I really support Lewis. You? Being a black oh, man I and thriving. Man. You're the I best in a sport that, I you know, Lewis. doesn't have a lot of people of colour at all. I think he's the only black. He's got to be the only black. He's the only black person there. And I think... He's um, the only person of colour, isn't it? Yeah. All white. And like, I was, when I was growing up, I was a big Formula One fan. I oh, used yeah. to, I love Michael Schumacher. What happened to him broke my heart. Because yeah. that, like, he was like... Is he dead? No, I think he's, yeah, he's they've heavily implied he's in their vegetative, vegetative state. Yeah. Um, and like I used to just obsess. I used to watch it every week. Besides mm. watching Man United when I was a kid, um, and like just to see a black person do yeah, basically no, match what he's done, fucking crazy. I, I I've it's not watched crazy. I've not watched the sport. He's cold, but I, he's so yeah. cold. He's such a good driver. All I know is, is that he it's better than Don Trotter. That's a real question. <laughs> right. So he's driving, <laughs> yeah, and he's doing a good job. You're the worst human being ever. He's driving and he's doing a good job. Man said he's better than Dom. Um, <laughs> Family, innit? Come on, Doug. Come on, Doug. I think um, <laughs> in an elitist sport for a black person to succeed like that is fantastic. Yeah. Um, His story is really nice as well. Yes. Morris, Morris, Morris Green. He just he just had character. What does Morris Green do? Sprint. Oh yes, of course. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. He yes, was the course. only individual that just had way too much flair and character, and he, you know, you knew who he was. Besides Bolt, besides Bolt, he had the most charisma. Yeah, for sure. Besides Bolt, just out there, just yo, I'm ready to just sprint and beat everybody here. Mm -hmm. And he, he did bits, but then of course, I mean, there's you saying, but I mean. That's just a goat of all goals. Yeah, man. nah, man. When he yeah. was hot. 2008, 2012, that boy couldn't do no but wrong. On, uh, listen, Kobe here. Bryant, yeah. I, to be oh, honest, I, 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 fed into, I fed Kobe. into the media and just how they they played him to be like a super villain. Like, he was the GOAT. Do you get what I'm saying? But he was happy to play that role. You get he didn't energy, care. Didn't he yeah, didn't no, care, didn't. but... Um, I, I, I mean, if you were an athlete, would you obsess over your sport that much? You know what I mean? Yeah, you have to. No, I don't know if you have to. You have to. Everybody there is out to come. Is out the out out. Everybody's okay, there to be, to mate, okay, you. to be the best. I think there's I'm a lot of people from, respect, from the perspective. Of I think there's a lot of people who are good at their sport or even great at their sport and ain't like as dedicated as them. Man, I think Wesley Schneider said, "Listen, I could have been with Messi and Ronaldo, but like, too busy. there's life in it. I was you know? busy. Sometimes <laughs> life has to chop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't let like, don't let life chop you." Yeah, but I, I think I think there's a dedication. I think some people will treat it as a job and some people treat it as a purpose. Like, like if, yeah, my, if my job is if if my purpose is to entertain, then I'm gonna be the best entertainer, better than everybody else, and I don't care what it costs. And then some people treat it like a job. I'm gonna do the best I can to make sure that I fulfill the criteria and maybe overperform, mm. and that's it. That's where you have the two. In, that's where you have the two mindsets. Nah, I hear that. Do you know Son said he's not um, getting married till his career's over? I said, Yo, what are you doing, my guy? His dad told him that. How old is he? Yeah, I think he's, he's in his late twenties. Twenty nine. He's a great player, though. One of my favourite. I know that's player. hard to say as an Arsenal fan because he plays for Tottenham, but Son is a different sort of great. He's a fantastic player. I'd, I'd have him at Arsenal in a heartbeat. Mm. He's a fantastic player. I think that's what, what you were describing describes uh, where certain elite artists fall. I think if you were to ask Ronaldo, what do you think about what you do? He doesn't look at it as a job. Yeah. When he was talking about coming back to United, he's like, this isn't like a play-play thing. I'm not here to just he wants to win do the necessary thing. I'm here to win. Mm. Do you know what I'm saying? And I've, I, I think only a select amount of artists can do that and maybe it might be because you earn a certain amount of money where it doesn't matter no more mm. but i think for him like he's just that's his that's his legacy that's his purpose in life just to be the greatest of surprise of no one said messi 
Uh, I love Messi. I mean, you can't watch football and not love no, Messi. Him, yeah. But I don't know. I think he's never been my guy. He's means. he's Ronaldo's no. He's Ronaldinho's perfect son. That's how I look at Messi. Yeah, I see what you're saying. Because yeah. he he basically is Ronaldo, what Ronaldinho would have done if he had been like, you know what? Fuck all the gimmicks. Fuck all the chit chat. Let me just do this to the most highest efficient version. And he and Messi does it, and nobody else has ever done that to that level ever, mm. and they never will. But I just kind of like the, the flair of Ronaldinho a bit more. Yeah, I yeah, liked yeah. him putting people on their ass and just the shooting from thirty yards winning. for the sake of doing <laughs> just, it. But you know, Messi. You know, come on, man. Messi is the greatest Messi's football clean, player man. of all time. Like we can't you even think have he's the greatest football of all time. Yeah, yeah, yeah okay, yeah, yeah. interesting. I, think, I so. think I've always said I think him and Ronaldo are one A and one B. <clears throat> yeah, 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 yeah. I, I just I yeah. can't see it any other way. I, I think, think Messi's. I think Messi's. I. Do you know what I think? The peakest thing about Messi. The peakest thing is his passing. Mm. Like you can't be a, you can't be an attacking player who scores that many goals and be able to pass like uh, Kevin De Bruyne like that. Well, yeah, what is that? That's, that's just a that's fucking insane. cheat, bro. And do you know what the thing for me cheat. is um, with Ronaldo, it's just I really like his story in the sense of it seems like he more or less just woke up one day and said I want to be one of the best footballers in the world because his season before so he comes back from the World Cup in two thousand and six. And he just has an insane season. Mm. A different human being. It was like Man United bought a player. A different player. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Because he was all... When I remember watching United early days, I kind of looked at him, not like a side man, but like when when uh, Giggs and, and Beckham were in, in front of him. I don't think Beckham was. No, Beckham was, wasn't there, sorry. He was always first choice right midfielder, like, but he, he just wasn't have that edge. When he first came, he wasn't that guy. No. He wasn't that guy. And then... Well, the rest just, of the it was just all, I don't even need to It was it, all the me. tricks and flicks that he used to try and do. And he used to just, I think, I'll never forget, Mavuja Nishray apparently got really angry at one, him once in training. Just said, You're so good, you're always in the right space, just square it. This is actually what kind of annoys me about Pepe a little bit. If you know, just fucking get, get the your ball out your feet, look up, you'd have way more assists. And that's when Sir Alex himself said, which is crazy. Mm. Sir Alex was like, He picked Ronaldo over. Over uh, um, Ruben Istroy, who was our top scorer at the time, he said, "Listen to Ru He said, "Rude, you're in the wrong. Like, let him do what he needs to do." Fuck. And that's when, and then the season after that, that's when we sold Rude, and then we made Ronaldo the guy, and then the rest is well, history. The rest you know? is indeed fucking, history. It is. That's bonkers, bro. That's fucking like imagine being a manager where you have your prize asset. He's he's delivering, but you see this potential in some kid who hasn't really shown it yet, and you pick him over. I don't know. Your I mean, main don. That's why I say Alex is the greatest manager of all time. Yeah, fuck, I watched the Fergie doc, uh, the Fergie movie the other day. I was close to tears at the end, man. I'm not gonna lie to you. He's that guy, bro. Ronaldo's He's my boy. Fucking nuts. <laughs> yeah. So Alex Ferguson is fucking nuts. Outside of the sport, outside of like the talent, if I was to pick the guy, it's him. Do you know who's really it's fucking? Not, it's I, fucking I, him. I'm finding really interesting at the moment. Roy Keane, actually. I just think his real Roy. honest conversation with I put in a in the football chat. The with, uh, overlap with oh, he's such YouTube. an interesting like, I, need to watch I get it, it in this well, you have a football chat yeah you have a football group chat yes there is a football group chat dedicated to talking about football wow what's the issue here <laughs> you gotta wow. tell me wow <laughs> i didn't make it i was added and but who's I'm the admin of the group chat it's jabbed why <laughs> okay but um jabbed if you're listening to this yeah don't worry fam you seen him worry. tomorrow isn't it can have words <laughs> <laughs> anyway um, um what is the third and final topic? topic uh it's another question so and this could be a bit of a short one actually to be fair Go ahead. what is a song that everyone um else has liked but you just could not get behind what is the name of the guy who sang the somebody that i used to know song fuck off that song is amazing you leave now didn't care for it. <laughs> just didn't care for it. Everyone loved it. Are you kidding me? Yeah, Homeboy go? was no, you just somebody that, that I used, used to know. Somebody. What's, what was what actually your problem? Didn't Honestly. have anybody that I was nah, supposed nah, to know. Nah, man. Nah. Let's throw hands. That boy made one song and left and said, "Yo, that's it. I'm out. I yeah, have, have this." Couldn't care less. And Homeboy when was I, when, when I was on the well. floor. That was my song, man. It didn't, it didn't move me. Live that when, 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 didn't when, move when, me. When, when I must have been in a good politicking. place. <laughs> staff members were just out here politicking. I must have been in a good place. Mate, just, just causing ruckus. If you tell me when that song came out, I'll tell you if I was in a good place or not. But it didn't move me. 2013, uh, you're 2014. bugging, man. That's, that 2013, I wasn't in a good place. When that was a not, phenomenal yeah, no. song. He yeah, was getting 2014. busy. No, nah, it didn't move me. It didn't move me. And, and the Sorry, way guys. Homegirl leads it boom, into the chorus. Boom, boom. 
And then Ooh. she's like, oh, no, nah, you're a but I can't believe this. I I'm can't. Not, I can no, not. I'm here to tell you all the truth. Nah, <laughs> so you thought you knew me. Am I somebody you used to know? <laughs> <Just> <laughs> <laughs> so like, how, can you, to be. how can you not like that song? That song's... The, it's clean, man. Like, it's I, a good song. I, I'm not I, saying it's a I bad even song. I do to say it's flawless. I don't know where the problem is here, man. I couldn't care less for it. It is flawless. Do you know how rare it is for us to agree? I know. I'm not calling an enemy here. I'm I man, you're cat. And this Bucky, you lot of laying it down, no, man. You lot beating me up. No, I, it didn't. It didn't work for me. It didn't I'm work for me. It didn't work. I got the appeal of it, but it was one of those songs I was waiting to just leave. I know it's a bad opinion of mine. It really happens, but here I'm we are. I'm really upset. Man. How about you guys? <sighs> but I'm that like, one came to mind. I don't know why it came to mind. It just did. Oh man, just to be his whole career. Say what? Now the boy's been in cool. Jesus' name. No more cap. <laughs> He's, the boy's done some good in stuff. In Jesus' name, no more cap. Man said his whole career. Boyfriend slapped, man. Nah, nah, I don't know about cap, that. Cap, it's cap, it's cap, it's cap. <laughs> Peaches there, slapped. There, there's been some. Are songs you kidding? Up. Peaches. Yummy slapped. I, I don't know. You're being sarcastic, uh, aren't you? Yeah, yeah, Ask me if I'm being sarcastic. Uh, yeah. Well, lie know. on my life. I, I could, I, I could see the appeal in maybe Peaches. I don't know. I like all thing. those songs. I, I actually typically like his singles more than the more than average like i do I, like I, his I, I like him i think he makes good music i think he i like his albums but i, I don't know about like yum, yummy and the thing is i've always felt i like yummy man was always played a character not himself yeah I, I can i can get behind that and that's what's really destroyed me from liking his whole did you not like this, this that was from. my favorite phase it was the best phase it might have been did you not like you probably wouldn't have liked like the uh, clubbier yeah. songs like um what do you mean? I'm sorry. sorry. Yeah, he was in his bag. Man. I he thought he was good. like he was doing it. Was it's not my type of music, but I thought no, these are these are good singles. Wait, there was a, there was a song where it's like um, sorry in particular was just like yeah, I know what you're trying to do and it, it is doing what I need. I'm just to trying do. to think like there's obviously been songs. My mama don't from, like you, but she likes like everyone, everyone else. Yeah, yeah that song was that. Right. The biggest. That was a really good album actually. That uh, purpose, I believe it was called. Yes. Um, big hits. On I don't that. know. Big oh, hits I don't know. Album. There's some Ed Sheeran shit that really be like people be loving, and I just be like, and I like Ed. Like I will say, I want to make that very clear. But sometimes he has he be having songs, and I just I'm not, I'm not sure about it, man. Like I weren't crazy about Shape of You, but that was inescapable. Um, what 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 songs do you not like on Ye? Let's get all of them up. What songs? Ye? Do where do I begin? Man, so I, I only like yeah, maybe yeah, two yeah, songs yeah, on the yeah, album. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why are you why are you trying to fight for that album? I don't hate the intro. Even though it was random as fuck. Tweaking, tweaking on the do see. I thought ah. about killing you. I don't hate that intro. I think I like Yikes. I all like Mine Yikes, is actually a good song. I like All Mine. That's where it ends. He, he, the, the, the writing on All Mine was atrocious, so. Supermodel. What did he say? He said something. Uh, all of us won't be here without outcome. Oh, hey. Oh, I don't know who's writing for him. Someone is obviously not giving it a go. This album is not trash. Say, Shut up. Anybody who thinks this, this album's trash, man. Why are you riding? Why are you riding? Ghost Town is boring. The same mistakes. I think that's the name of the song. I don't nah, really man, care it's, for it's it. not a good album. Man said, when did you say hi to me, use I one I or but say hey with a whole lot of wise. I said, I... I said, fire your fucking ghostwriter, bro. No, nah, that that was him. That was that him. was him. What that the was fuck? Him talking about. Do you the, the I'm, even, was, I'm even questioning now. Come out. No, 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 hold, hold on. Hold on. It was the track. Remember, um. What's this? Kanye West and Andre 3000. He says the WID. That is a reference to that. To, to Drake, basically. Yes. Saying hi with a whole lot of eyes. Yeah. I don't... I, I make good music. That's, that's my bottom yeah, man, line. Stop it. Stop it. Both of you stop it. Well. Just stop. It, yeah. Make good Fucking music. Fucking putting better than Travis that. Scott on Fair Trade. Ruined a per what could have been a phenomenal song. Better you than don't, that. I, Dark I, Don't invite me to your pee parties anymore. I said, yo, that's a... He was trying to get busy with the captions, man. Daft decisions. Daft decisions. Putting on that TSU bit at the beginning of TSU. Daft decision. What are you doing? Just get to the fucking music. Making uh, 21 Savage give you a phenomenal <laughs> verse, but then making him, allowing him to put that horrible hook. Gang, Gang shit, shit, that's, that's all. all, all I'm all. Shut the fuck up. Shut up. You're 36. That is bang, bang. <laughs> wow. Oh um, God. Sorry, where were we going? Yeah, songs that we... I don't know. I think the shape of you is probably a prime example. I just couldn't get behind it. Um, I'm trying to think of ones that when we were younger and it was like it was everywhere. Um, 
But I think I'd be capping. I was Did quite... you guys like Kevin Little touch a bud? Well, not touch a buddy. Touch Let a me. Bu- What's the name button. of the song? Touch Kevin Little, <laughs> Let Me Hold You. I went crazy up. about that. I, I, do you know what? No, I'm going to say I didn't oh, really particularly. Turn like me on, that's the name of the song. Because the only reason it was really popular is because of Jay. Yeah, I, I, I never Jay used liked to be that obsessed song. with that song. I've never liked that do song. Do you know whose songs did slap, though? Yeah, man. You know, Sean you know Paul's why? song slap. Do you know why? Get Busy was, though. And term. The video for Get Busy needs to be up in a gallery somewhere, man. It does. That's some legendary shit. Gotta get busy. Oh, man. Nah, I don't Sean even know Paul what was back, that guy. To turn me on, yeah. I didn't know he was I used black. To live, I used to live in Ilford. <laughs> and then basically, <laughs> I... Go on, dude, man. Yeah, I used to live in Ilford. Wait, basically, so, I was next to the pub. No, no, no. Oh, hey, big man. Hey, I'm talking, nah, bro. I'm halfway through my story <laughs> and you're cutting me short. I thought it was culture appropriation on my life. <laughs> big man. Wait, what's this? What's up, Paul? I didn't think was black. <laughs> nah, he's not. He's, he's hey, French. He's black. <laughs> Vin Diesel's black. Hey, he's French. <laughs> he's French, bro. He's. I'm actually crying. <laughs> yeah, nah, he's, he's French. <laughs> <laughs> Oi, I'm in French, tears. French, French, oh French, my French. days. I'm not gonna tell my story, man. It's nah, done. please. Nah, <laughs> nah, do it, do it, do it. Nah, We're just being childish. Is, it's, it's so what? Been. Sean Paul's not black. <laughs> I'm actually crying. He's not black. He's not black. Oh so, shit! Well, I thought he was black. No, I think he actually is black. Like he's, he's partly, he's, he's partly not. black. I know he's, he's got like a crazy combination of shit. Not, like I thought that was culture appropriation. What you thought was like? He's French Jamaican. That white guy that sang that Informer song. Oh, yes. My Lord. Oh my days. What Listen, that was a bad one. And they give them now. <laughs> oh, you were getting busy. Yeah, that's a true oh. story. He basically got off bail for like I think attempted an uh, an AM, and that's oh, what the song's shit. about. What Someone tried to, to be alive. Fair enough, man. Yeah, because there was a lot. Snow of, was like, getting. <laughs> Snow was really out here. Getting you know? busy. Yeah, no, there, there was there was a lot of. Uh... Were there any Nelly songs you guys were like didn't fall? Uh, Air Force One. Yeah, I didn't know. What was the, the, to me anyway. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I think yeah, that's the one I'm show. thinking about. Actually, was needed. Um, but Nelly was getting busy, man. And what can you say? Shake Sh- Sh- your tail feathers, dumb. Care about there's one I didn't care about. Ooh. I actually have a lot of controversial opinions when it comes to this shit. You know I me. Mean? I'm quite picky yeah. with pop songs. Some, some I'll ride to the wheels fall off, but then there's others I, I, I can't gravitate towards for some reason. Um, I don't know why. I, drop I'm that shit for me, or was it dropped that down for me? What Liam Payne was on. I thought you were going to say uh, Jason yeah. Derulo. Oh, no. Jason, I'm not Jason. I'm Derulo. Jason. You know what? It, well, had, you know? it, had, it had his time. Jamie, are you down, 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 down? I liked it at the time. I'm not going to I'm not gonna hold him against that. Down like she's supposed to be. It's my least favourite version <laughs> of Wayne. <laughs> All of that, like, Wayne pop shit, like, um, I think the song's Mirror with Bruno Mirror Mars. Mirror and the... I hate that song. <laughs> I I actually hate that song. No, man. <laughs> Big man thing, I hate that song. I can't stand... That's my it's least favourite really version song. of Wayne. Yeah, it's a really no, amazing honestly. song. And it worked. It banged. He, he, was, he was very successful. Bruno Mars. Is there any songs from him you just Do like? you know what? I don't really like his music, but I like him. If that, if that makes sense. Wow. Oh, that's Cap. Wait, there was a really yeah. good... Uh, that's what I like, I do like. But I'm that's not particularly like. crazy yeah, about like his music. When he, the, oh fuck, you when you couldn't escape it at uni. Um, what's that song he had? With uh, oh. Mark Watson. Oh, don't believe me, just watch. Oh. You know what? I like the song, but there's a big, like, you know, like an asterisk. Whenever I heard it out, I, would, I don't even want to say this, trigger warning, I actually wanted to kill myself. Because every time I heard that song, it's so happy, it's so uplifting, oh, oh, and like, you know, in those settings, in the club settings, and the, uh, uni settings they loved it but i just well, really? i'd hear it and i'm like michael moore tried to ruin my first year i'm not even gonna lie this shot. is the moment and now is the night don't know yo so listen so... people be in the club thinking that's church you know <laughs> and when the last be, bit nah people... nah 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 hey, listen they get into their bag when they hear that shit people be thinking that's church i'm not lying man they be praising bruv they'll be yeah, they'll be with, bank, you know man. like you know like you just see one brother that you don't know but now nah, we're boys <laughs> And they have you, their arm around you, oh, and they, yeah, they jump mate. into the. No. Oh, this is the moment, mate. This oh. is the moment. No, is the I'm moment. not here for that music at all, man. Macklemore tried to. Be, I liked Thrift Shop actually. Like Thrift Shop's was, cold. Yeah, I'm not gonna. Spitting, I'm not gonna hit on Thrift Shop. But I, uh, yeah, that that other that other tune. You tried to ruin my experience, man. On God, in jail time is needed for real. A lot of people can sit their ass down. Oh um, man. You know what? This this petite song by by NSG. I'm, I'm not feeling it. 
Shake it, baby, don't, don't break, break it. it. I like what it. What was that? Why? Oh, I didn't like um, man, man, man. No. Oh, I hate that. <sighs> I hate he that song. he could have ruined clubbing, you know. I, I, swear hate, to God. I hate that because song because everybody in the club wants it's to say it. the N word, it? And they are singing it because it's oh a song. Oh my god, oh, that, that Lil Dicky and Chris Brown song. I hate that said, song. As Yo, well. I hate that song as well. And I like Lil Dicky. Pause, no. pause, 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 pause. Why you like it? You I said pause. I said pause like twenty it. times. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say? I said. I'm I'm not going to say it again. I'm not going to say it again. Shout out to Paul Bridges, man. I said I like Lil Dicky. Pause. Oh um, yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's a man. Um, yeah, I don't know, man. This is actually a really good topic. You, we could go for, like yeah, you could be here all day. I mean, I you know what? You know what? I don't, I don't like, like. I don't like why I hear an original version and then they remix it. So oh, there was worse. there was the Snoop Dogg. Um, I'm gonna make you wet. Like that song, there was an original version. Then they clubified it. Then yeah, they, it was already yeah. pretty clubby. No, 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 no. It wasn't. It wasn't. I'm gonna make you sweat. Hey, no, no. I yeah, was, that's that's the club version. But the club version obviously went on to be more famous than the it, original. We, yeah, but it's just not us. It's I hear not that. For us. Um, oh man, what there was there was just so many. It can be that, that, I did not like smack that. Could not stand but it. That's, that's a that's a banger, bro. Bags. That song is cold. Bags. And then I was like, and I love the video as well. Eminem over rapping. I never understood. Like back in the day, I used to take lyrics like. Um, very like visual. Um, how, how do you say that? You would take lyrics. Um, I know what you're trying to say. Like you visualize you would, you would, the lyrics. Yes, you would visualize the lyrics whenever it's spoken. So when they mm. said smack that, I'd be like, "What are you smacking?" Mm. Yeah, I like. The, I think the song is great. I love. I love every, nah, every nah, bit of the song. Oh. And I know Eminem's your boy, but <laughs> this is this is the thing now. Isn't it? Oh, you know what I don't like. <laughs> That's my boy. Hate it or love it. The no version, way. The original version. I don't like. I don't like the original version. I don't care for it. I don't care for it. I Everyone mean, loved it. It's a masterpiece. Everyone loved it. Don't care for it. I don't. I get it. it. I get it. I, know I, what love it. To I don't like the original version. No, I like no, the I remix with the whole G unit. Oh, wow, shocked. I, yeah, I don't care for the original. To be honest, the remix was okay, but I, I, I definitely don't care for the original, man. But I'm yeah. no, nah, that's a beautiful song. It is a good. I won't. I won't sit there and criticize. Woke the song. up the next day, nigga just sold my bike. <laughs> Yeah, that's that's the song. Hey, I think like. he was going through it. Yeah, that. for real. I was really feeling that song because yeah, it's like, yeah, yo, yeah, man, yeah, like, yeah. you know, someone take your bike. Oh, yeah, that's damn. what. Nah, Fifty was in a bad place. <laughs> oh, do you know what song I genuinely hate with my soul? What? Mm. Sean Kingston, beautiful girls. I hate really? that song. Uh, I, I, I mean, fucking yeah, hate it. Song. Was, it was very much nah, of his time. it pisses me off, bro. I don't know why. <laughs> Maybe it's in a resentment. I don't like that song. I like beautiful girls, but I don't like the song. <laughs> I, fucking that I, song, I need bro. to clarify I do like Beautiful Girls <laughs> the song um, itself just not the song by Sean Sean of Kingston Sean Kingston yeah say his name again Sean of man said Sean of that might be the name of the episode <laughs> Sean Shaun of man said Sean of um yeah man nah, I, I mean yeah it's one of those we'll topics we day. could be here all day yeah. I think it's just it's, it's just interesting how much especially when you're younger that some of the songs we mentioned when we were younger and at that age you're more or less trained just just like whatever on the radio but you I did like not it. like number one um Tinchy Strider and then Dubs I like that one part oh I like my god I like that one you point. are my number one it, it didn't I age very well nothing. it didn't age very well it nah none of that music did but some, anyway, I mean some, and Dubs some, were getting some, busy some, man some, some, some. oh some in dub song is I definitely swear, aged. Fam, That's give him, give him, give him Grammys for that. The ground. It wasn't. It, if it wasn't, <laughs> <laughs> I always yeah, yeah, you yeah, around. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm not gonna let get anything in, in the way. way. If it wasn't recorded on a potato, I think it would have aged a bit better. Some yeah. of this. Oh my! Do you know what? Like I swear, it was a, that weird Wiley area um, that was really popular. I couldn't get behind. Yeah. That I think it was Heat Wave. Heatwave and the other one. I like Ayaya, I, 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 but I, 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 I couldn't get behind Heatwave. I, 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 oh, what did um? Oh, even that song. Skepta no, had a horrible no. bar on that song. I, I didn't hear that. Yeah, it's just it was, it was a weird time yeah, for music. Yeah, yeah, well, was... I can't stop. I can't understand why these bumblebees trying to get my buzz. <laughs> <laughs> he said that bar. I mean, yeah, gave, he actually gave Wiley a really bad verse. I would have said we'd do it. Do you might remember um, Sunglasses at Night? Yeah, uh, that's my, my sunglasses that night. What was the song? Red, but it's all blue. <laughs> I got my eyes on you. <laughs> that's the name of the episode. No, nah, sunglasses that night. You know what? Nah, Let's get into. I don't know. Was, nah. Quickly, songs from that era that we really enjoyed. <laughs> hey, Wiley was getting busy. What's the one with the foxes in the video? Uh, uh, Rolex. Rolex. Where am I rolling? The video is hard as shit for yeah. the girls and the 
<laughs> See you at lunchtime. <laughs> oh, you know what I'm talking man. about. They were getting it in. I was enjoying myself. Listen, shout out to the Cybercaf, man. Yeah, Come on, dog. Five at day cafe, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, mate. Nah, we was enjoying when we were younger, man. Some <sighs> dumb music. That's Some funny absolutely yourself. dumb music. I, I'm going back to I Swear by um, N-Dubs. I know it was recorded on a potato, but my, they were getting busy. Shanika, I, listen, man. man. Shanika, and what? Damn. I swear, remember the time don't even tie me to a chair. Kiss me through my back and my neck into my ear. You know, that was exactly the exact same voice. You don't hear that no more. <laughs> yeah. You don't hear that no more. Nah, you don't, man. Even Dappy don't be using that voice no more. Nah, he's yeah. been using his normal voice now, isn't it? Thank God. But um, no, that was, <laughs> that was a really good conversation, actually. I really enjoy that, lads. Um, That's funny as hell. I can't believe you don't like Do you know what? And now that we're going to go swiftly into our picks for this week, I'm putting Gossier, some somebody I used to know in the playlist, I'm man. Picking my I have to. Real, real G shit. I, I really wanted to put that song at one point, but thank you, for Demi, for doing that. I can't believe you don't like that song. I am, I couldn't, I am flabbergasted. I, I have a weird thing in my brain where like there's certain... like. Uh, pop songs that don't really translate well in my head. I don't and know. And I don't wanna live that way. And echo every word you say. I tell you say. this much, and this is not even Colin's logic. I actually prefer the, the Firefly song. Oh, uh, uh, no, that song is so bad. Oh my god! <laughs> Fuck! I, like I, I hate that song. <laughs> that song be coming on. I, 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 I just immediately uh, turn that shit off. <laughs> That song's a banger, bro. Nah, man. I'll be in a crowd of my life. <laughs> he, <laughs> he, was not, he was not getting busy, man. Dog. Um, my choice this week. Jesus Christ, I don't even know what to pick. Uh, I'm gonna wake me up. Wake me up inside. Inside, man. Inside, bro. I never. I never. <laughs> come, come, that. my lady. Come, come, my baby. <laughs> my man was in his bag. <laughs> With my butterfly, sugar, baby. <laughs> Oh shit! Okay, my choice is uh, Millions. He has a song with Javon called "Hometown." It's on his new album. Javon, yeah, 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 yeah. Javon, I think his name. Yeah. Javon. What is in fucking Drake's Javon? Oh no 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 no! That's uh, no no not him. Uh, UK rapper. Okay, I, no, I always millions, pronounce his name wrong. Man. I think his name is Javon. Millions He's a cold is rapper. One of my favorite. Um... His tape is good. His tape yeah, is, is good. It? Okay, yeah. Um, no, I have to give it. A I think it's decent. I tried to get through T on, and I was just like. Maybe you're Too better. samey. Yeah, yeah, I think he's better at singles, which I don't think. I think now it's not a bad thing. Yeah, it's not a bad yeah. thing at all. It's really hard to put together a good album, man. Honestly, yeah. Um, but yeah, I'll give. I have to give millions. Um, no, absolutely. Shouts out to how, millions, man. How similar is this? Is a bit off topic, but how similar is yours and Soph's music? Music taste. taste. Um, uh, 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 it is relatively similar. Mm. So any big release you'll listen to. I mean, when we got into the whip, she was playing uh, Juggernaut <laughs> so, yeah. by Tyler the Creator. So you kind of get a feel for her music, um, but she will listen. She would. She can put on a JB album, and I'll listen to it. Type thing. Oh, okay. Um, yeah. But no, she. Yeah, it is. Really, she loves Drake. So when you know I play Drake, she will never complain. In it. Fair enough. Uh, and she loves Ye as well, actually. So if I play Ye, she won't complain. So it's relatively similar. Yeah, yeah. I'd say so. I'd say so. I made a playlist <coughs> for you know who. Yeah, she didn't like wonderful Travis Scott. I said, "Do you know what? Should I end this now?" But you know what? Do you know why you shouldn't even be mad? Because nah, nah, obviously I'm being silly. Like obviously, no, nah, I know, I know. <laughs> but but certain certain one of their their um their collaborations work. So I prefer what's the one? What's the other one that they yeah, have? But we really enjoyed wonderful. I liked wonderful, but I don't think it aged very well. I st I think I like Thingy more now. Wait, the what's, one. What's wonderful? Uh, on, uh, Travis Scott on the weekend. I like the one more on Flipping Rodeo now. What's the name of that one? Wonderful, wonderful. What is no that? praying for love. I think I like really? that. One. I think that? I like it. I don't know why I like it more nah, now. I love Wonderful. I was just I, because me and her had that what conversation. Is uh, it's oh song my by Scott. god, a wonderful Full time. He put it at the same time as Butterfly Effect. I think. Yeah, it's not my, it's not my song either. No, I'm really, fr I'm here for it, man. I love that fair, song. Fair, fair, like, fair. And I really listened to it again, and I was like, Yo, that they need to make more music, they too. Them too. Yeah, no, they just just same vibe, but they need to make way more music. Yeah, uh, yeah, like Travis and. I mean, they do come together every time they've got an yeah, album. Yeah, they do come. Yeah. That song's dead still. Anyways. I need him to do something on weekends. Ah, oh, but that'd be dope. There was no features on his last tape, was there? After I was no, not a single feat. What, what guy? What album? Blinding lights, baby. I mean, I was so happy for him because I'm a massive fan of his, but couldn't get behind that song. Going back to our previous topic, uh, what Blind and Light? Yeah, I think the song, the album had better um, songs. I don't like it at first. I didn't like that song at first. No, nah, I still me. don't. I think it's cool. I don't hate uh, it. In your rides is a beautiful song. In your, I uh, hate that song. No, no, no. I don't mind that song. I don't like Save Your Tears. I don't like Save Your Tears. 
Um, See your tears. For another day. I didn't know that. Was <laughs> and echo every word you say. <laughs> and father, that I should let it go. But right, you want to burn it. Demi, Demi, Demi. Auto tune, bro. <laughs> I'm going to be present. I thought, tune, I, was hit, I thought I was hitting them notes. <laughs> no, when we hear it in the earphones, it's different, bro. Ah, okay. I hear yeah. it. Don't yeah. let the, let the lifestyle. I don't know what the name of the rest the name is. Yeah, yeah. Drop your choice. Spoons. Mm, 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 S P Double O N Z. I hear that. West Side Gun featuring. Oh, Kobe. for oh, fuck's sake. sake. You got oh me now. <laughs> Get off the stage. Ah! <laughs> I was in Dyk when I was not rude. <laughs> I said that was not rude. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> Bow. Uh, nah, nah. Let me change the song. The coming, dude. Let, let me change the song. Nah, I'm keeping the cocaine hey, whipping yo. up. So when the uh, when it's coming, <laughs> when it's uh cocaine, when is the uh, crack coming? To... <laughs> so we, we, <laughs> that's the best clip of all time. He's a dumbass. <laughs> Don't be keep that song, keep that song. Yeah, I've I've never seen the context. <laughs> so what what when it's crack? How would you change it to cocaine? <laughs> <laughs> the way he separated the crack, he was like, so we've established the crack. When does when does the, when does the no, we were talking about the court case. When, when does the crack come into the picture? Who was he talking to? <laughs> who does anyone know? The, who that, was Flex I talking to? I don't know. I don't know. That's one of the best talking. clips of all time. I'm sorry. I yeah. find I think I have it saved on my phone. <laughs> I, 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 I hope I do because set man need to see that because that's so dumb, that's man. So funny. Oh, I've been having a conversation for maybe next time. Like, what's our favorite memes or videos that we have? Yeah, that's gonna be. Oh, uh, nah, it's the one for made in Chelsea time. for me. Fuck! <laughs> oh, I'll never forget. I was going through something when you posted. It, I was in. I, where did Eddie find this? I'll never so forget. I posted funny. it. Um, I was going through something, and basically, Collins was like, "Your first thing was my like, my reaction was being Spider Man." I was like, "Yeah, yeah closely followed by <laughs> fuck." <laughs> Yeah. He made an absolute mess. Like you're gonna clean this up, you know what I mean? <laughs> Before you leave this establishment, you, you number one, you gotta pay for that glass that you broke, and number two, you gotta apologize to the people who the, the, the drink went on. What the fuck? Are you, <laughs> imagine the you video is so dumb. You see someone do that in your in your bar, like, are you mad? I really I know you're upset. I understand you're are they upset. Are recording? It's but, like it's like reality TV made in. Yeah, I was. I put it in the chat. It's just in, the uh, dumbest video Chelsea ever. Um, like, what the no, fuck are you doing, bro? Four or nine on their card, bro. Nah, you gotta pay for that. I'm sorry, you gotta pay for that glass. Um, card, bro. The one you from me, Love huh? Island when them man are busting. <laughs> <laughs> That's the best one. Bro. Yeah, but he was a mu- he was he, he, that that video doesn't make any sense because it's like he played himself. He played himself out loud and thought he was the don, and then that, realized that, was, that you're not the don. No, that was a sad way to go out, man. Crazy way to go out. He re- he really <coughs> took a nail. But um, yeah, Made in problem. Chaffee podcast episode one hundred and six. There you have it, man. We hope you lot enjoyed. This was a lot of fun. Yeah, no, I hope was. you enjoyed as much as we did. <laughs> uh, please like. And only real music is going less. All the bullshit says they ain't going to Please like, subscribe, hi, hi. share with your people. Dems hi. hashtag MRC Pod. Leave us a review. Hi. Tell a friend. Tell a friend. Love it. And until next time. Peace. Yeah. Are you trying to do the Ellie Golding song? <laughs> <laughs> that was gross! <laughs>